In this video, the SOLIDWORKS wrap feature will be shown. This feature takes a sketch and wraps it onto a planar or non-planar surface. The wrap feature can be used to create designs or text features on areas that would be difficult to do any other way. A sketch must be created on a planar face or else a plane that is parallel to a tangent plane that lies on the surface to be wrapped. The sketch can contain closed contours, but there cannot be any open contours unless they are construction lines. If using text, it is a good idea to create a construction line that the text can be placed on. This allows easy and precise placement of the text. Once a sketch is created, exit the sketch, and while keeping the sketch selected, select the feature which can be found either under the Features tab in the Command Manager or under Insert features, and then wrap. Next, it is necessary to set the wrap parameters. Choose the face that the wrap feature will be applied to. Choosing emboss will create a raised feature on the surface. Deboss creates an indented feature on the face, and scribe and prints the contours on the face. Choose the thickness for either the emboss or the deboss. If necessary, reverse the direction of the feature. If you want the sketch to wrap on the surface in a direction other than normal to the sketch plane, choose an edge or face in the pull direction box. If left blank, the wrap will remain normal to the sketch plane. I hope this video has been helpful.